The Idaho Vandals put another strike in the loss column as the team now sits at 0-3. The Vandals would lose 36-24 to to the Ohio Bobcats Saturday on the road, but despite the loss, Coach Paul Petrino continues to see a driven team. We just got to get it done, but we're right there, and we're, we're improving, and we're growing. We're coming closer together. We're fighting harder for each other. I, I told you, I was proud of that. Our guys fought their tails off. It's just now we just got to execute a little bit better, but the fight and the want, it, it's there now. So that, that makes me proud of them. The offense puts up 24 points against a tough defensive Ohio Bobcats. Again, led by quarterback Matt Lenahan, who threw for 355 yards and two touchdowns. Lenahan made school history in the process by becoming the first freshman quarterback to have three consecutive games with over 300 yards. Despite throwing three interceptions against the Bobcats, this young quarterback leads the Sunbelt Conference for passing offense with a season total of over 1,000 yards. And Lenahan's passing yards puts up at number six nationally after only three games. Idaho trailed 17-0 in the second quarter until they forged a comeback. Running back Elijah Penny would end a nine-play, 76-yard drive with a touchdown from one yard out, putting the Vandals on the scoreboard going into the second half. Idaho's defense gave their team a much-needed momentum swing when a touchdown pass to Ohio receiver Sebastian Smith was called back. Idaho's defensive back, Quinton Bradley, ended the next play early with a sack pushing the Bobcats back 13 yards. The Bobcats turned the ball over on downs, and the Vandals took over just inside their 15, where they're able to get the ball on the one-yard line. But running back Elijah Penny was unable to convert. Yeah, and I, I would do it again in a second. I thought you got a half inch to get, you should be able to get it. You know, and we needed to get it, and we needed to uh, block it a little better. And the runner needed to get it no matter what, but we didn't get it. Late in the fourth quarter, Idaho answered in less than a minute after a touchdown by Ohio. Lenahan completed a 52-yard pass to Josh McCain to put the Vandals just five points shy of evening the score. The play was called out of bounds originally, but after further review, was overturned. Idaho will play at home Saturday against the 1-2 South Alabama Jaguars in their second conference game. For Sunbelt on campus, this is Dan Jewell, University of Idaho.